Horrid, Henry. Are you sitting comfortably? Good. Then let's begin. It's not easy being me. Wash your face and brush your hair. Oh, nag, nag, nag. It's just not fair. I'm Horrid Henry. Sometimes we're school. I'm gonna So sweet, I'm Horrid Henry Na na na, na na nay The purple hand gang rules okay well, It's so easy being me I'm Horrid Henry You know those days when you're just minding your own business and things are going pretty well and you've had a hard week at school and you reckon you might just get away with watching Gross Class Zero all evening? I call this story Horrid Henry's Fun Run. <laughs> ah, yes! Gross Class Zero on the TV. Slush mush and nose pickers in my tummy. Ah, it doesn't get much better than this. But it does get worse than this. Because here come Mum and Peter to ruin my evening. Honestly, Henry, look at you, just lying around watching TV and eating sweets. So? So, all this stuff is bad for you. Hey, don't turn the TV off. What do you do that for? You don't get enough exercise and you eat far too much junk. Yes, Henry, it's really important to get your five a day. Silence, worm. Don't be horrid, Henry. Actually, all of us could do with more exercise, which is why I've signed us up for the fun run. Yay! Woohoo! The fun run? But there's nothing fun about running. Ooh, it'll be so lovely to be out in the fresh air, running round the park with lots of other families. This is so unfair. Just because you want to get more exercise doesn't mean I have to. Yes, it does. Come on, Henry. I'm sure you'll enjoy it if you give it a chance. It's time for you to be fit and healthy. Well, you know what I'm going to say to that, don't you? And that's where it all started to go wrong. Mum woke me up early the next morning. Rise and shine, Henry. Your new exercise routine starts here. Ah! Whoa! The early bird catches the worm. Speaking of worms... Good morning, Henry! Oh, isn't it fun being up so early? I can't wait to start getting fit. Careful, you'll burst your nappy doing that. Don't be horrid, Henry. I want you downstairs and having breakfast in two minutes. But it's Saturday morning. Oh. Huh, nothing good about this morning. And it looked like it wasn't going to get any better, judging by what was in my breakfast bowl. This is delicious and healthy. But it looks like something from the bottom of Fang's cage. Eat up, Henry. We want to get down to the park early. But I was one step ahead of her. The park? Uh, oh, we can't go there. Why not? Because of the escaped leopard. He's eaten three smelly nappy babies already this week. Don't be silly, Henry. Well, that worked. Time to try something different. So unfair. I need rest and ice-cold drinks. Don't be so dramatic, Henry. Now hurry up and get changed. What if I was really injured? Oh, they'd never believe me. 
but they would believe Peter. Ow! My foot hurts! Ow! Poor Peter. What's the matter? I don't know, but it really hurts. Oh, what a shame. Why don't I stay here and look after Peter while you go out running? Yeah, let me take a look. Hmm, wonder how this got there. What? I just accidentally dropped a teeny-weeny stone in his shoe before we left the house. Don't be horrid, Henry. Looked like there was no tricking, Dad, and it looked like there was no getting out of this run. It was raining when we got to the park, and it was cold. Now, be honest, your family would have turned around and gone home at that point, wouldn't they? But, oh no, not my family. They were going to run, and that, it seemed, was that. We'll start with an easy one, just as far as that tree. As far as that tree? But that's miles! Come on, Henry! See? That wasn't so bad. <coughs> not, not so bad! I just run a marathon! <laughs> Admit it. It was fun, wasn't it? No, but at least it's over. Now let's get a taxi and go home so I can watch Gross Class Zero! <laughs> over? Henry! That was just a warm-up. The fun runs not until next week. You what? There's going to be a lot more training between now and then. And there was a lot more training. On Sunday we did star jumps. I said I couldn't do star jumps because the slush mush had frozen my arms and legs. But they wouldn't listen. Henry! Henry. On Monday we did muscle building. I told them that I'd used up all my muscles in PE at school, but they didn't believe me. Henry! Henry! On Tuesday, we took turns on the treadmill. I told them to turn it down, but they didn't believe me. <laughs> on Wednesday, we did weightlifting. I wish they could see that I was wasting away. Well, they couldn't. Henry! Thursday was toning. Toning, I ask you. I don't even like singing. Henry! And Friday was the psychology of sport. Whatever that is. Henry! But Saturday was the worst. Definitely the worst. We were back in the park. 22. 23 doing sit-ups. 24. 25. With the birds and the slugs and the squirrels and Hoppy the dog. Oh, no, not Hoppy. Hoppy, no. He likes you. Great. So now I had a family that were fixated on fitness a not much fun run the following day, and a new best mate, a smelly, licky, hoppy, pesky pet of a dog. You might think that was enough for me to get the rest of the day off, but Dad had something else on his mind. Now, how's your sponsorship coming along? My what? Sponsorship. I've got Miss Lovely and everyone in my class to sponsor me for the fun run. And I've got every one of Tingly Toothbrushes to sponsor me. Where's your sponsorship form, Henry? The one I gave you a week ago? Um... Oops. Does this ring any bells? Oh, that sponsorship form. The Fun Run is a chance to raise money for charity. Yes, that's the whole point. You mean, if we don't raise any money... Then it's not worth doing the fun run. Well, yes. Hmm. 
No sponsorship, no fun run. There's got to be a way out here. Eureka! That's it! OK, Dad, I'm going to take my sponsorship form and knock on a few doors. Like this one. I'm sure our neighbours would like to help out with a good cause. Do you want to sponsor me for the fun run? It's for a statue of Mad Moon Madison. It's for a new snot slimer. Come on, just ten pounds a step. Ah, oh, well, I guess I'll just have to tell Dad the bad news. So, how did you do? No sponsorship, so no fun run, I suppose. Yes, fun run, Henry. You'll just have to sponsor yourself. What? That's so not fair! And then, at last, it was the dreaded fun run Sunday. We all lined up. Starting positions, please, everybody. There was no place to hide. Mum and Dad went jogging off with my smelly, nappy baby of a little brother, trotting happily beside them. Oh, this is fun! <laughs> Couldn't they see? I was in torment, agony, suffering in the most terrible ways imaginable. <gasps> so tired! I can't run another step! <sighs> Eureka! That's it! I could take a shortcut through these trees. If I follow this path, I should come out right by the finish line. I swerved off the fun run route without anyone seeing me, and within minutes I was inside the wood. It was a bit dark and gloomy. Hey, where did the path go? Oh, it's a bit spooky in here. Supporters waving and clapping. But they were just a blur. I even felt myself break through the finish line. But I didn't care. The leopard was closing in on me. I saw it pounce, jump. Help! I'm being attacked by a leopard! <laughs> <laughs> for me to recover. A lot of rest, a lot of TV, a lot of sweets and a lot of time. I made a start as soon as I got home by catching up with Gross Class Zero. But just as I'd settled down, the doorbell rang. Someone to see you, Henry. It was Al and his dad. Saw so, you yeah, at the fun run today. Really impressed with the way you tackled running through the park. Which is why we want you on our cross-country team. What? But that wasn't me! You're a natural. Dad, it wasn't really me! Tell them! What a good idea. And don't worry, rain or shine, we'll make sure he's there. There was really only one thing I could say to that. No! It's not easy being me we'll Wash your face and brush your hair we'll Nag, 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 it's just not fair I'm horrid Henry So down with school, I'm gonna rule And when I'm king, I'll do my thing And then my life will be so sweet I'm horrid Henry Na, 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 na The purple hand gang rules okay it's not easy being me, I'm horrid Henry. Na na na, it's not fair. 
na na nay, I wasn't there. Why do I get blamed for everything? Cause I'm Horrid Henry. No, it's not easy being me. Tidy up, just look at your hair. Nag, 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 it's so not fair. I'm Horrid Henry. Going for a hike Goody goodies girls Anything with girls Sitting up straight Having to wait Cleaning out fang Doing my chores Cleaning my car Is such a ball I don't want school work Any kind of work Work Don't want to do them anymore Cause when I'm famous I won't care I'll never wash Or comb my hair I'll be king Of everything King Horrid Henry it's not easy being me I don't know why they cannot see Just how hard it is to be Horrid Henry So down with school I'm gonna rule And when I'm king I'll do my thing And then my life will be so sweet I'm Horrid Henry So down with school I'm gonna rule And when I'm king I'll do my thing my life will be so sweet I'm Horrid Henry You have been listening to a Horrid Henry audiobook And if you like this one Then there are loads more for you to enjoy <laughs>